Well, thanks for joining us, Douse. Finished three apiece here. Yep. Given 3-1 down, you must be delighted, really, to come away with a point. And it's a difficult place, isn't it? Oh, yeah, we've got the best home record in the league. And rightly so, and to be fair, he's done a great job. Uh, gone over, had budget cuts and things like that with years. And a uh, very informed side and don't lose many games here. So, a uh, 2 nil down, you know, like, uh, listen, it's a game of... I thought the subs were right, what we put on, and that proved a point, but their front four were quite frightened, to be honest, and we never had a way of handling them. And, um, you know, I don't, obviously, Ben and Kevin, who I had a hamper, and I didn't try I didn't try to say that work, and end up being the best player on the pitch by a million miles, and turn anybody inside out. And So we have a word, and we have a passed it and moved it, and things like that were very, very good. Uh, but we dug in, and the one thing we have got in the team is character, and we're still top of seven games to go. Um, so, uh, you know, and the, the gap's building, and now for the top two, the gap's building all of them but yeah we probably used to get up with jail card a little bit um, in the last two games but it, it, it might not be that actually might be a character what we've got and a character what we've got of Harvey coming on and showing some enthusiasm up there and you know at least coming on and running at people we haven't had that um, for a while to be honest so I was pleased with that where if you look at their lads we have got a high pitch and intensity and running at people and one twos around the box things what you encourage our, like our lads to do we never had that and um, until these come on until Harvey come on so um, it's just little things they got where you know um, I've got to be delighted about the battling qualities but it must have been disappointing perhaps to concede that third yeah. almost right on the stroke yeah. of half time having almost weathered the storm I think because we had a spell when we were quite good and we had a spell when we thought oh let's go get me in a half time like you said would be fine but um, you know to concede like that again and uh, you know you're looking if you want to have a crack at the title like I keep saying the first goal was a many mistakes where Marnie doesn't make a tackle out there we'll let it go for the corner we do it's a free header and you can't have that man you can't have a free header if you're trying to do things not the height we've got in the team so in the second goal was two things down this right hand flank with Brennan to be honest and um, so that's very disappointing but to be fair it was a game of, you're not going to come away from home against the third top team and the most informed team at home and blink and you know concede three goals and um, and win a game of football you're not going to do that so uh, but we, we have scored three which is a plus and I did, I did think getting the team did I get it right probably not defensively um, to be honest um, but attacking wise and the subs wise I've got to praise the subs because I thought we had changed the whole mentality of the game I thought Harvey coming on and running round and I thought Reese coming on and being direct I thought it changed the whole dynamics of the team very open game very open where it could, if it had went on it would have, you know, it would have been 4 three, five, whatever um, even you know, even he had another good three all it did, and uh, all of us. It was a very, very open game, and um, you know, a, a game where forwards probably come up on top of it. Um, it's bit, like, listen, I'll see it again. Like I, I looked at their team, and I look at uh, only got four on the bench today, and all that, you know. But that front four, uh, we have here players quite frightening, and I think we'll take anybody on them. So hopefully, um, you know, we can learn from the little mistakes we we'll make, and hopefully, we can kick on and uh, we'll go from there. So it'll be okay. And what a fantastic strike from Alassani, wasn't yeah. it? Oh, brilliant girl. That's what he can do. That's what's frustration because he. He's done well in his first game and he has a couple of games I'm thinking he's not doing nothing and he's come on today and been a revelation really and you know run, direct, strike just all the things we wanted the front lads to do and what their front lads done um, you know and then Harvey come along and being a bit of a nuisance and put himself about a bit so it was you know it's pleasing to get that and I'm pleased with our supporters who come and it is a, like we've all said it's a tough one of games coming up and everybody's saying we're tough and talk he's tough and all of us did, but the bottom line is nothing's changed at this minute. We've seven games to go now, so if we win all seven, we win the league. And we've said that from the last 15 games, so that's keep coming down now. So uh, we're still a point top. People say, well, Torquay's got a game in hand to have, but they've got to win it and they've got to play us as well. So, uh, and we have at home, so it's a good point that we are uh, the, the best form say at home. And uh, at the minute, we've dug in a little bit, Torquay's certainly dug in, so it's quite exciting, really. And Amani Little came off, seemed to be feeling no, his knee. What's no. the position there? I've got, got a clump, like, and um, you know, we need Amani fit. He's our best player. Let's get the cards on the table. If he's fit, you know, he's our best player and he runs things he does, and you know, he's exciting to watch and he gets there and he, sometimes he tries too hard. And having that a few shots in this time of season is practice. So when he's not on it, he's, um, we feel it and all that, you know. But to be fair, the subs were made to go 4 4 2 and it seemed to work, you know, it seemed to work. So um, I just, you know, just the liveliness, that's all. And, a few things I've got to iron out a bit, which I will do. And you know, I'm going to go back home now. And I've got to feel Justin, Justin, I think I've got to, you know, I, I have said I'm, I'm after a few players to make with that a little bit better for the final seven games. And I'll stick by what I do, but not loads of players, just one or two. And uh, you know, like, uh, Jolly and you know, um, all over there, uh, I thought I lost the battles in there today against a very good, it's just a, uh, you know, they're not a bad side, yeah. And, you know, um, 
So, um, but now we either, and that's a good point away from home. And no Greg Lure in the squad today no, either. I say he's got a hamstring or a hamstring, and obviously Musa have played off his hamstring as well. And I thought it might be in a, a quite a short change with Cookie coming in actually, but it wasn't. But uh, you know, and, and obviously Cookie's got to have a shout now because obviously we just conceded three goals. We can't keep conceding goals, so. Is, um, I did rest them and you know, maybe one of our two centre halves the rest now will play a three or something like that. They're just there. Uh, and if two full backs obviously had an off day to day, didn't they? And, um, and you know, they've been solid all season as well. So it's just one of them where if we get the full backs better and uh, defensively better, then um, we'll be fine. Lovely. Thank you very much for your time, Dale.